Hello guys, we've been playing this new deck builder game called Wild Frost. You're gonna see a lot more of it, it's crazy. Now, one of my friends was telling me about this gnome infinite. This gnome infinite, you gotta play the gnomes, they're broken. For those who are curious, what is the infinite? What are we talking about? Enjoy. I think I wasn't recording that last run. Modifier bell, okay, it's the last bell, what is it? Titan bell, harder boss battles, but item rewards will contain more options. My mistakes, exactly, Space Odyssey. Just learn from my mistakes and it's easy. All right, this applies three silence and it's aimless. More importantly, it enters Gnome Land. Why is Gnome Land important? Well, because we like gnomes, but we also want to try this infinite. His name is Killbag, by the way. That's kind of a sick name. Killbag. Fletch Root. Killbag it is. Killbag. All right, let's go. Sneasel. It's time. Three streaker bust here. Luminate. Luminice. Luminice is formed during a rare phenomenon where water from erupting hot springs is instantly frozen, creating a special type of ice that feels warm to the touch. These luminized shards possess a unique ability that amplifies the effects of those who hold them or the items they are infused to. The town of Snowdwell is built around a massive glacier of luminize, providing its inhabitants with a warm atmosphere of soft light and running water, making for a safe haven for the unforgiving frost. Water from up is instantly frozen, creating a sort of ice that feels warm to the touch. That's a cool, that's a cool concept. All right, we have every journal. We're reaching the game. This is it. We're unlocking the game. We can move the crown if you guys want. What would you guys rather cr uh, have? Sneasel crowns for the first fight? Or Junkhead? Let's do Sneasel. Two shade clay with Nomlin. Apply two flame to the front. Goes infinite. I gotta see those cards. Shade clay with Nomlin. Apply two flame to the front. Goes infinite. Is Shade Clay a card that can keep, um... You know about the Naked Gnome? I do not, no. Snowzuka is, uh... Oh, yeah, Naked Gnome. If you don't kill it, you unlock it or something. I already did that achievement. I already did the achievement. I did the achievement. I, I kept him alive, and we got... Uh, what did we get out of him? We got something out of him. I forgot, though. Shake Clay is consume copy and item in hand, and Newman lets you keep copy and second copy. Ah. I see. And then you have overburn. So it copies the item, applies overburn to the front, consumes, keeps going, keeps going. Got it. That's cool. I, no, I got the I got the unlock, but what is he? Is he the one one two cooldown? I haven't seen him. I mean, I, I haven't seen him in a long time. Okay, let's go. Apply snow. I gotta say, my my starting build is pretty trash. This is free five gold. The, the number is just five gold. Thank you, Nome, for your contribution to my gold. Appreciate that. Winter Worm and a Goblin. Hmm. Goblin. Goblin. Um, I could reroll. Get my Sung Sung box. Hmm.
to play the junk. That's my bad. If I play the junk, I get free gold. Should I be doing that? Mm -hmm. It's sounding like this is actually not that smart. Oh, I had junk head for that. Not a problem. Let's keep you around. I'm gonna farm this gold. We gotta make big money. Big money baller. Big money baller here. So if you silence... This thing does nothing. Look at the snow knight. What a little... What a little... Alright, I wanna, wanna get myself that nice... Link money. Sung Sung Box. Sung Sung Box, Day June. Thoughts? Or Sung Sung Box on Sneasel. Sneasel is gonna 1v1 this guy. Guy down. We roll. Keep some some boxing. I don't have any more. So this goes whatever it hits. It gives me free card draw. All right, I'm kind of excited to see if I get snow ring. on top that I missed. So I got 63, which is not bad. 63 is okay. It's not that great. I, I, I apparently I missed a common code on top. I, was, I, I must have missed it. So we get companion, companion. Oh, let's try this. Companion, blink, companion. Although if we go for charm, we can find ourselves the lumen charm and be on the way to infinite. But I think I'd rather go for some companions and get some direction in my life. I want Nam and Stompy. Oh, Bomb Bomb, boys. So Bomb Bomb, we decided, is a solo laner. And when she gets close to dying, you just recall. She's worth a try. Anybody want to claim Bomb Bomb? Space Odyssey. Okay, what's next? What's next? What's next? What's the next companion? Jumbo and Crego. When a card is destroyed, I gain one. I would, this is another tank. I could have two tanks. Oh wait, let's go with Sneasel, isn't it? Tanks, Sneasel, I like it. Goodbye. It could backfire though. I want to crown Space Odyssey now. Jumbo <laughs> farted in the elevator. That's a good way to put it. Right, let's get Space Odyssey out. Space Odyssey. Gonna get shit done. So where do you want to go? Space Odyssey right here. Sounds pretty good. Got a little Sneasel. Got a little Jumbo. 
play both. Jumbo and Sneasel. Best of both worlds. Dajun doesn't have much health. Dajun, what happened to your health? You don't like John, but she, but she synergizes with uh, Space. Yeah, but I think Space is going to be a recall guy. Recall uh, champion. I feel like Space is just... Be a big tank, do some good damage, AoE, handle a row by yourself, and then recall, repeat. We'll call it the R&R. &R. Or I could even get, you know, honestly, just put a junk head behind and get some junk. But we're not in that situation right now. Card draw. No, 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 no. This guy's gonna die. So this guy... It is what it is. This is weird because Tinsel doesn't do anything in that situation. Yeah, she does. Yeah, she does. Wish I had... I wish I had a 3 combo. That would've been sick. Got Ice Lantern. So now we can switch it up and put Space Odyssey bottom row, kill the whole damn row. Wait, what if I get Space Odyssey smack back? That could get crazy. Could get crazy. Did you guys stomp and copy? Yeah, yeah, if you copy my stompy, you're gonna have big success. We get to silence the goblin. Now silencing the goblin allows us Do I wanna silence the goblin? So I didn't get gold for that hit because the goblin's goblin that's bad, that was bad, that was bad news. That was bad news. You're not running though. You ain't running from me. All I know is that you ain't running. But you're also not giving me gold. And that's a problem. So Space Odyssey's got to go ASAP, but it doesn't heal to full. So what I want to do is do something like this. Because we want to get the gold, right? Gold is pretty important. She's very good. Hey, she's very good. Fat ass helpful. Solo tank. We got Sneasel for we're, we're gonna we're gonna try to head into infinite. Goblin's trying to run from me. I can snow zuka it. Ain't ain't happening. Not in my house. Sung Sung box. Sung Sung box. She's great though. Wait, Space Odyssey's nuts. Seven? Oh my god, she's good. But you, need, like, but you need a lot of companions because it sucks to start off with 10 HP, so you need to do some rotator potato. Can you silence space? If I silence space, she loses um, barrage, right? But she also doesn't kill herself. So yeah, it's possible. You wanna try it? Let's try it. She kills the goblin. So here's what we could do. We could do a little junk junk. A little junk in the trunk of the goblin, get some gold. And then we gotta figure out how the hell we're gonna do this. Uh, this Ringer. We're gonna play Ringer with Junkhead. Easy as fuck.
Combo. Now we get a little junk get in the mix. And no harm, no foul. We can rotate potato space odyssey. See, so here's what she represents. Let's do that. Get the guy going. Silence. And let's go for the kill. That's it, right? We, the fight's over. Good fight. We're at 207 gold. So we got ourselves a blink and a boss versus a charm, a shade, and a charm merchant. Well, charm shade is interesting. But I don't have any cards that I want to duplicate. Now, if someone to say, hey, you have, you have a chance to duplicate a card, what the hell are you picking in this situation? It depends on what the charm is, right? Because if that charm is a lumen, then I can start doing some lumen junk heads. That doesn't really help me, though, because you only go infinite once. So what the hell do I even want to duplicate? It's really early for this dude duplicator. On the other hand, I can get a treasure, which gives me more direction. Then I get another companion, which I don't really need more companions at the moment. And I get gold. Now, gold is good. I kind of wish that I could go to the Charm Merchant and then go to the Shade Sculptor so I can get some more direction. Yeah, I don't have anything I want to copy necessarily. I guess I can do another Companion, but I'm kind of already good on Companions, to be honest. Although Jumbo is kind of lackluster. Although Jumbo has Barrage Effects, and Barrage Effects is an easy way to break the game sometimes with charms which gives credence for the charm path let's do it there we go now we have instead of a jumbo it's a snaffle the problem with snaffle snowball charm on that guy yes it has barrage so it aoe uh, snow but it also applies it to my companion behind. So now that I think about it. Now that I think about it. Putting frost on my own Sneasel doesn't seem good. Put it on ink? I guess you can put it on ink, but this is really trash. Because then I have to also duplicate a card. You put her behind before she attacks. You could put Jumbo behind. Yeah, you could. But then... Do I just duplicate Sung Sung Box? That bug's not that great. It's besides she would snow herself. <laughs> That's interesting. So it's besides the... No. It, look, it, looks, it looks like it wants to be in Jumbo, if anything, because of jump, because of the barrage effects. Then put Jumbo in the back row, I guess. That means I no longer can do the Jumbo Sneasel stuff that I was doing. It's kind of bad. I already hate this path though, because now I don't know what to duplicate. I guess Junkhead. More Junkheads. She doesn't hit herself, she just takes up 6 damage, right? But do you really want to put Snow, uh, do you really want to put Snow on Stace Odyssey, or, or do you think she already kind of handles it? I'm pretty sure she won't, because she doesn't. I mean, don't you think it's kind of backwards, though? Doesn't she kind of kill the robot herself? She's bloody as hell, by the way. Double flash or double junkhead? 
think about double box, but I think junk is probably pretty decent because then if you have more junk heads, that gives you the ability to get more trash, and trash allows you to pick up cards that require recycle. We'll try to do some rec recycle stuff. Let's see what charm we get. Lumen ring, lumen ring. Apply three silence. Wait a minute. Now, wait, what is this? It's Chucklefish, which means it can have as many charms as it wants. Gotta be honest, not the charm you want to see when you're at this uh, juncture of time. Put this on Space Odyssey. Space Odyssey now is three silence. What does Balance Charm do here? All right, space. Go stupid, go loco. But I could have put it on Jumbo. Jumbo could be AoE silence as well because he attacks faster. So think about it. Jumbo attacks every three turns. Maybe he's better with that. Because the Space Odyssey, unfortunately, kills herself. I think Jumbo was better. Because Jumbo goes off three turns, so he, he can be uh, a CC bot, right? He could do Snow, three Silence AoE every three turns, and he doesn't kill himself, more importantly. Space Odyssey is a limited quantity. But, damage is done. Let's move on. We did what we had to do. Did I move my crown? Yes. It looks like I just added Bambuji to my deck. Yeah, I don't know. I think Jumbo was probably better if I thought about it a little bit more. But it's okay. It's okay. We're gonna we're gonna make Space Odyssey be a thing. She's like mainly she's like a damage thing, but if she either have to decide you want to be a damage thing or a CC bot, I think CC bot is probably better. Okay, let's go. What do we want? What do we want? What do we want? Go freeze something. Let's freeze this bad boy. Smack back. Oh, we get smack back and it's game over. Okay, that's what we're doing. We're getting smack back. Oh, we gotta find a way to not kill her. Self. So you know what she needs? She needs to get shell or health on kill. Then she's amazing. Doesn't keep the silence. What? Ain't keeping the silence. I gotta recall her. She's dying out here. Why does she have eight attack? Yeah, only truffles. Yeah, only truffles. But trouble never splits. If that happens, it reminds me. <laughs> I hate how this thing's still attacking me. How about you don't? I gotta recall Space Odyssey. 
Boozle is trying to do some stuff. AKA apply snow. I don't like that. What? You couldn't apply science to the big, big boozle? So we gotta get into the silence again. Silence is gonna make sure that BAM doesn't do anything. Alright, so if we silence one of them and kill the other, it's GG, right? So with that being said, I could silence BAM and kill Boozle. Bam kill Bozo. I can't let Spisadji attack actually. Yeah, it's supposed to recall before Bell. Yeah, I can't let her attack. I just realized I can't let her attack. Wait a minute. Unless I silence her, but I don't want to silence her. Yeah, I can't let her attack. I gotta recall her now. Aye, that's a problem. Do it before the bell, yeah. I was supposed to do it for the bell, 100%. Fuck, one sec, one sec. You know? I gotta drop back into her. I gotta drop back into her. Where the hell is she? Where's my girl? Only 9 HP, huh? If I kill Bozo now, Bam doesn't get anything. I don't want to overdo it because the Winter Worms are still a problem, but the Winter Worm in the bottom is 2 HP. That's not a problem. I can reroll into her now. The Winter Worm on the top is a problem. Actually, Winter Worm on the top has 4 damage. It ain't nothing. Because Jumbo's just doing one damage and making it had no damage, so that's fine. Let's re to our girl. Let's play Space Odyssey bottom row now. She kills the bottom row while I silence the top, or vice versa, one of the two. I could draw into this gear hammer, which is useful. How? Not really. I don't need to draw into that. I'd rather just do Space Odyssey and then Sung Sung box her. <laughs> hey! What's going on, you two? Fighting. I know it sounds scary. Uh, let's play her. Okay, so check this out. Check this out. Check this out. We silence Bam. So when Boozle dies, Bam is just easy, easy quantity. This thing's doing two damage. Is two damage a problem? Nah, Jumbo's a tank. Jumbo's just a crazy ass tank. And then we're gonna do Sung Sung Box on Space Odyssey. 
So Bam doesn't get anything. That's, again, I got Tank Jumbo. It's only doing three damage. That ain't nothing. Sunshine Box right here. Kills the whole bottom row. Problem is she's taking two. Kills the whole row. Now she's level one HP. They thought she, you're, you're carrying. They're a hard carry. Now we got the Snow Gobbler trying to do some work. Snow Gobbler wants to kill something. So what is something that would want to be killed? I don't want a Jumbo to be injured. J Jumbo's my tank. So Jumbo is my tank. So if I want to injure something... I suppose Sneasel can be injured. Which kind of ruins the effect of Sneasel. But Sneasel's just there because they're trying to go infinite. I don't actually care about Sneasel. She's just there for infinite. I don't actually care about Sneasel. I know that sounds mean to say. But I don't care about Sneasel. And now I gotta start working on killing these things. Because Jumbo ain't doing the job. What's the counter on this guy? Five? These guys are so slow. Bye bye Sneasel. Let's kill these things at the top. And then we kill Bam, give you all the gold. So we can recall her and then re, uh, redraw, right? Didn't draw her. Recall? Really need that Dejan guy? Yeah, you really need that Dejan guy. You really need that guy? You can kill the winter worm and then so I can hold on to this. If I hold on to the winter worm, check this out. I but Bam's trying to go crazy. I don't like that. You know what would be good? If I recall into Snow Odyssey, she, she can tank Bam. That's a good idea. Huh. You mean to tell me I drew six cards? And the seventh card was the thing that does the thing. We had lethal. Well, I was gonna do the hammer to get the gold. I want to kill these things. It's about gold. It's not about lethal. It's about gold. I don't think it turns to lethal. Um, damn. Now I want to have an injured. I'm gonna have an injured jumbo now, which really goes against the whole tank thing. But sometimes that happens that way. And let's play Space Odyssey and win game. I have lethal in two turns. GG. Okay, we have 206 gold. Card draw, rebel. So, rebel's interesting. Rebel's interesting because I have a lot of cards I want to play, right? So, if I want to play a lot of cards. While I'm playing my cards, my rebel is coming reactive. So cards that I want to play would be things like... Wait, I had no cards in my deck. What is this deck? Wait a minute. I want to play Junkets. Uh, get re I'm getting rebel. I, I didn't have to have Jumbo injured, but it's okay. Not the, not the end of the world. We gotta get cards, you guys. You know what gives me cards? Not fucking companions. Whoa. Someone tell me why this shop is glowing. Why is the shop glowing? Got some goop? 
Jerma, there is a big popular Jerma. His name is Jerma985. The special item or parrot. Well, here's the thing. If a charm market gives me Lumen Ring, and Lumen Ring is infinite. So if you see Lumen Ring, I want everybody to scream. Oh my god, it's a bomb barrel. But it has... Consume. Wait a minute. So if I get Lumen Ring plus Bomb Barrel, I crown that, crown the Junkhead, crown the Sneasel, Lumen Ring the Junkhead, then I have Infinite. Oh my god, that's a Sun Charm. Sun Charm Space Odyssey? The Bomb Barrel is pretty good though because... It allows me to go infinite with the Lumen, but I don't have Lumen, so. And so Sun Charm. Why is Sun Charm so cheap? I feel like, isn't Sun Charm like a, a crazy charm? Space Odyssey now attacks three times, or would you rather save it for snack back? It's a really cheap Sun Charm, I don't know why. Two things we could do. Make Jumbo attack every two turns. This guy could have been a CC bot. This could have been a two turn AOE silence snow. But now it's in Space Odyssey. She attacks every three turns, which is pretty good. She already can't attack enough. Why do you say that? She can attack twice and then recall. You'd rather wait for Smack back. But this not when I recall her, that means I can come back and uh, she attacks in three turns. Wait for smack. I want this. I'm gonna save money for the shop. Gobbledy gook. No big boy, huh? He's a big boy, huh? He's a big boy, huh? Uh, looming goop could be used to fix something. Blaze Bomb. Oh my god. Blaze T. So I'm not sure what the goop is going to do. So I'll buy it. We'll just roll the dice. Blaze T Crown. Thoughts? Is Blaze T on Space Odyssey even good? You'd rather charm? But Blaze T on Space Odyssey does 6 AoE poison, uh, 6 AoE silence, 2 snow, 14 damage. But then she also kills herself, no? But when she goes off, it's crazy. Silence for the rest of the fight. Well, that, silence doesn't matter because if she's doing 14 damage, then they don't need to be silenced. Yeah. Charm twice trust. How can you charm twice instead of crown? Exactly, exactly. Silence and snow are not good when you're doing that much damage. So let's go ahead and uh, charm first, see what we get. Because I want like, that lumen ring. Wait! Well, I need smack back. Now we have... Now we got a little bit of sustain on our space odyssey. Got a little cloudy odyssey going on here. Does that still give her enough leeway? Well, if she kills the whole row, it's as if she didn't attack. If she kills the whole row, it's as if she didn't attack. Now, why am I getting told to get double charm instead of a crown? Is there something related with Goop, or are you just a Charm Fanatic? Cause I'm gonna go ahead and get that crown. Cause you gotta keep in mind, my main goal is to get Junkhead, um... 
And main goal is to get Junkhead Infinite. So I'm looking for Lumen Ring. Get in there, Space Odyssey. Why are you injured? Who wants to get stun charms? What about Day June? Just apply silence everywhere. Yeah, Lumen Ring's a charm. I know I can buy it for Lumen Ring, but I'm saying, um, I'm still not going to sacrifice. I still need crowns for the combo. So I need to still have one, two, three. Oh, I have enough crowns. I have enough crowns to do the combo. Yeah, we're good. Now we have enough crowns to do the combo. Yeah, yeah. If it's shiny, I go there. I mean, that's kind of self-explanatory. I buy a goop. It has no text. It's mysterious. Something shiny. I'm going to go to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've gamed enough in my life where I realize you go to the shiny things. Um, I don't know where sometimes wants to go, though. Well, that's enough crowns, no? Sneeze old junkhead. Uh, okay, I need to get one more crown for the bomb barrel, right? Yeah, I can't take this off. So, yeah, I only have two crowns. Um, okay. You want to put it on Daydream because he applies silence aimlessly? Aimlessly apply. What if I just hold on to Sun Charm? No, no, no. Let's give it to Daydream. You know, you, you asked nicely. You asked nicely. Might regret that, but it is what it is. Let's get out of here. Battle. Battle Brothers. Battle Brothers is a good game. I want to play that game again. All right, so where do you want to go? I want you to kill the bottom row. If I get Lumen Charm, it's over. But no, but I still need to get a junk generator, right? So, I need like Bomb Barrel. Get Sneasel out, or I could start Sung Sung Box, kill the Shell Witch. Oh, this guy silences her. Oh, it's GG. It's GG. Silencer ain't a problem. Get this guy out. And you wanna know something that's even crazier? I can slow down the Shell Witch. And she doesn't add any uh, effects. In this case, effects would mean two to all allies. Sure. Or I can also slow down the Conquer. Oh, but Conquer's not gonna live. Should I play some real games? A good game, dude. Uh, Drunker didn't want to do that. Dark, dark, dark. Let's go, Space Odyssey. Got Jumbo in the mix. If the normal could have one turn turn cooldown, yeah, that would have been, been sick. Would have been sick, 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 sick. What's a real game for you, Nicka Nick does? You mean like Fortnite? Play some Fortnite. Good jump well. Conquer does one damage, does two damage. That's two damage, that's two damage. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, figure out what are we doing with Prickle? How are we managing Prickle? We're killing Prickle. Wait, we're killing the whole row. The whole row, and we're healing it all up. Now that row is dead. That row is dead, dead, dead. And so is Jumbo. Jumbo is also dead. Shell Witch. So you're attacking me. That ain't a big deal. So here's what I can do. I can let this take the hit. I'm going to recall Jumbo anyways. Actually, I want Junkhead to take a hit so I can play Sung Sung Bucks. Is that crazy? Sort of crazy. 
I want you to stick around, goblin. Or I just get more gold. I hope if you got Chuckle Charm. Oh, I just hit my own Daydream. That's not smart. So I want to recall Jumbo and then recall and uh, re redraw. No. I feel like he's actually better. I guess he can tank though. You're prickling me. So I still take. Oh wait, if I silence you, oh, you're prickling me. Yeah, I don't want you that prickle. Let's go ahead and kill the Shell Witch and then hit the Conquer. Four damage. What a dude. Got Bogo. What a bozo. Okay, we got to switch roles here. We need you to go top row. Kill all that stuff. Conker's doing four damage. I can put Junkhead, tank that, get some junk. Now, junk is not that great. So a lot of junk in my deck already. We call for free. This obviously can kill bottom row, but we know what's more important than that is killing top row. So what I'm going to do is a cheeky little switcheroo. And that is going to include Sung Sung Box. Sung Sung Box. Space Hodges is going wild. Now we kill Pecan and we win game. I can even put Jumbo for the tank as well. Kill Pecan, win game. Wow, isn't this deck really nice? What a nice deck. Jumbo takes the hit. My injuries are now healed. Dejun kills this. You know, I could... You know what I could do? I could make it so that I kill Pecan and Bogo same turn. Pecan-Bozo combo. We're in a good spot. I mean, we're going for the three-win streak. That is nice Space Odyssey. Turns out you just have a Giga Chat in a row. So I had Nam and Stompy last run. Now I have Space Odyssey this run. Turns out Giga Chat just does things. Giga Chat it. I... Not sure what I want to do. Does not care about the combo shit. All right, let's just kill Bozo. Bozo the clown here. Heal, recall. Hey, look at that. And the Bozo. The nine damage to the face. Not bad. Recall. Play. And it's GG. Recall into snow, GG. Snow gear. We win. Snow into gear. Time the commercials? I could time the commercials. I can make sure they don't run at all and then I do like an ad break thing. How how many how how long are the ad breaks? So they're all a heal, look at that. Now we're even stronger. So we got charm companion or treasure companion? Sorry, treasure, treasure charm. Heal charm did work, I know. Either Exactly. So either things that like get shell bell and kill or get heal and kill. And we called it and we got it. Now all we need is lumen. We have an infinite plus a space odyssey. So I need you guys to cross your fingers for a lumen charm. Oh, treasure, right. Now it's to the blood wine. Yo.
Thank you for the anonymous gift and blood wine. I'm sorry about the commercials, but now you don't got to worry about them. Is sunglass chime good? Feels like sunglass chime is pretty good. What do you got for me? Berry blade. Wait, isn't berry blade pretty good when you have a girl that's hurting herself? Because look at Gigi's cookie box. Can we call this thing trash times two? What does the cookie box want to do except be looked over? It's good for a bl that, little, that little tank. The tank that has scrap and damage. I don't got a tank. So, because you need to have attack on your thing that has scrap, which is that tank and something else. Oh, tank and mimic. Tank and mimic. But then you need two junk to play it. It's the berry blade for me. And I can help keep Space Odyssey alive. If I can heal Space Odyssey, then I can go ahead and um, get an extra attack in. Lumen Charm right here. Every time. Oh, pinche huevo. Como? Who do you want this on? I don't really got a second secondary killer. It, drawing cards is cool. It, it, it makes re uh makes you time your bells a little bit better. So like this, for instance, if I if I draw my whole deck out, this is actually that this is good. If you draw your whole deck out. And then Space Odyssey is about to die. You recall her, use the rebel trigger, boom, replay her immediately. But I don't really kill. I guess I can put it in Dajun. Well, good card draw means you just bring the bell less, but also it means that when you have your charged up bell, you can kind of guarantee what you cycle. So if your deck is fully drawn, recalling into draw gives you the Space Odyssey again. Because the way, the way it works, I believe, is um, the cards that are currently in your hand take last precedence, right, from the redraw. Maybe I'm talking out of my ass. Put it on the hammer. Make the hammer. Oh, Berry Blade. Well, Berry Blade, pink, Pinch Charm. Thoughts? Berry Blade sometimes kills? Yeah. Although Dejun's been doing some work. He's like handling the other rows. Dejun's killing the other rows. Nah, nah, we'll do Berry Blade. We'll do Berry Blade. Or just focus on one hammer, make a Giga Shadow Hammer. Honestly, not bad. So, where is the sparkly part of the map? I'm trying to do the, this little goop thing. Alright, I gotta survive this battle. Got Maru. Now, Maro goes bye-bye to Silence. Sneasel Jumbo. Jumbo Sneasel is a good way to get some card draw going. Got a Sunglass Charm. We also got a Berry Blade. This guy's got Fury. This guy's pain in the ass is what he is. Um, who do you want to silence? Silence the Fury? No, Junk has got him. Want to silence Aimless? Let's silence Aimless. If we silence Aimless, we get a barrage. Like, yeah, okay, it's annoying that this guy has thorns. But I also want to not have Aimless. But the thing is that now I'm not going to have barrage. I'm just going to have a one... Let's, Silence Teeth, definitely. We definitely want to silence Teeth. Okay. But that doesn't bother you that Space Odyssey is only attacking one in one individual? Kind of bothers me. Because if we silence the Aimless now, Space Odyssey is attacking the whole row. And then I can handle Maro in the back. Um, Let me see, let me see. I mean, because right now... Rumble's gonna be kicking my ass. Nah, Aimless actually overrides Barrage. This is what we're talking about with Isaac. So if you kill Maro, 
if the aim was hit, then the barrage comes up after. Like some kind of weird ordering thing that happens. Let me think, let me think, let me think, let me think, let me think. Um, so Dejun's gonna take 3 damage. That's a problem. Unless... Okay. Okay, I'm okay with... Uh, Okay, I'm okay with... Damn, but that Grumble's beefy, though. Fuck. I can hit both Deja and I could. Alright, guys. We're going for... We're going for Broke. You ready? Flash of Ink. Hit the Smog. Life is good. Now we can play a Jumbo somewhere. This guy is annoying, but I can silence him with Dejun. Is it Dejun? Dejun? I don't know. I can't really play Jumbo. Maybe Jumbo could be a tank, but... Am I better off just recalling? I mean, redrawing? I like Sung Sung Box on um on Sung Sung Box and Sea Getting that skill up attack is really important actually. Okay. So Space Odyssey attacks. Boom. But I wanna save this. You know what? I wanna save this. I wanna save this. I wanna save this. The reason why I want to save this is because they're about to resummon. Dayun, the J is silent. Someone correct if I'm wrong, but Roger will rise. Aim lives. It applied after the aim list and vice versa. Aim is overrides Roger, but it applied second. Okay, here's what I want to do I want to prolong Sunglass Chime. For, the re for when they resummon the minions. That's fair enough, right? I don't get combo gold, but... That's okay. That's okay. Is there a difference in the, in the order left to right? Like, can you place cards behind them? Yes. So... So, from right to left is the way they attack. So, this guy's gonna attack before. So, they're both turn one counter. This guy's attacking before this guy. So, that applies in certain situations where you want to apply demonize before this guy attacks. Or you want this guy to... Kill off the weak straggler in the front and the big attack kill the guy behind. Also, if um, this guy is the only one, can it, if there's nothing in this row and this is this row, then whatever's in front takes the hit always. And there's also some things like long shot, so long shot would attack the back row. Yeah, everything's relevant. And you can always you can slide around for free. So uh, here's what I, I want to recall Sneasel. And I want to have Charm Sunglass Charm go off next turn. I know it seems cray cray. But there's a method to my madness. I don't care about the gold that I'm missing out on. I, this is what I wanted. This is what I wanted. This is what I wanted. Now we sung song box. Coming from some young guy. Now we do this. Wait. We gotta kill Papa. Oh, Papa's not a problem. Goes right, to, so yeah, right to left, top to bottom. But there's like an, an, a, a level of like whatever's closest kind of thing. So gear hammer kills Papa. And now we can do sunglass charm. Ready? Check this out. 
big combo energy. Alright, not as much combo as I wanted, but it will suffice. Wait, wait, wait. Space Odyssey is going wild here. Slow down, Space Odyssey. I might actually slow my own Space Odyssey. Draw two on kill. Kill her. I draw two. Dejan finishes it off. And now she's just sitting there waiting patiently until I use Sunshine Box. Hell yeah. Jump for a tank. Oh, do I want tank or do I want to play Sneasel? Do I want to just draw? I want to just draw. Recall now? You want to recall now? No, I want her to attack. She's about to attack and destroy. She's about to attack and destroy. Except that's a silence that we got to use. Trigger wins hit. So what happens? What's the order of things? If I attack first... All right, hear me out. I silence. I sung sung. And then, does it... This applies silence when I hit. So does... You guys know what I'm saying? Well, I have a solution for that. Have no fear. I have a solution. Check it out. Doesn't matter. Because my solution is to put a freaking junk head in front anyways. But you guys are saying I'm good. Silence goes first. Alright, I'm trusting you guys. Because if, if you guys are wrong, well, then that's fucked up. Easy. Alright, and now we should recall right before the bell. The bell is going to make her... Actually... This is it. This is, this is the last... This is the last of the thing, right? This is it? There's no more... There's no more fight? So I can recall bell. I'm king of the world. La 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 la. We could do a berry blade on the smug and get some card draw. Card draw means space odyssey or something. But this grumble's a thing as well, which I don't like. I can take the grumble. No zooking. There's no combo to be had. Just keep snow zooking. Kill the grumble with the thing. I don't care about combos. Combos is a thing, but I don't really care. It's just for the 1v1. Keep silencing for the rest of his life. Play spice out because she's my damage. She actually kills herself, that's bad. No, never mind, she has 6-7 life, she does 6 damage, we're GG'd. That can't be a thing. Sung Sung Box. A little bit of Sneasel action, card draw, and some damage. And re-roll into damage, GG. Berry Blade, draw 2. Nice and controlled. Solo laner. Okay. So we can see some shiny. There it is, guys. Uh-oh. Shiny stuff. Well, you know where we're going. Charm versus gold. I'll tell you what.
we got Lumen Ring, we're infinite. But uh, at this point, I'm kind of just a broken record. But I, that's the only reason why I picked Sneasel. Yeah, the one we're forced to go to Shiny, yeah. Gold next charm, but here's the thing. A charm is 50 gold. The second charm is 70 gold. So I should just take the charm. Huh? Okay, let's take a look at this. Now, what the hell does this want to go? Gain recycle plus two strength. Which means it can only attack if it has junk to trigger. Is that what it's telling me? Put it on berry blade. Now, berry blade is five heal. Yo, as long as we have junk, Berry Blade draws two on kill, heals my girl for five. Okay, but now we need some more junk. Well, that's okay, we got junk heads. I like it, I like it, I like it. We're junk heads. Berry Blade. All right, we got the goop and the crown. Broken vase, okay. Buy that. What is this? The Lumen Vase. What does that do? No. Ooh. So can I have this card straight up now in the future? Or do I have to always combine it? Doubles, targets, effects. Okay, that's pretty cool. I'm not sure how relevant that is because I have Silent and Snow. It could be interesting. Only one person in the buff can have the buff from that card, by the way. Oh, wait, I can double it on my girl. Wait, 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 wait. I can make my girl do six and two. You can, you can replace Lumen Charm with the crown for the infinite. Oh, wait, isn't that the AoE? Isn't that the combo? Wait, you put it on Junkhead. Now I get double junk. Wait, that's it. So then the only thing is now I got to get junk. Wait, I think I got infinite. So let's take a look at this. Put it on Junkhead. Our junk is already here. Put it on Lumen Charm. And remove it from her. Put it on junk. So now we play Sneasel. Fuck. I'm missing a crown. I'm missing a crown. Fuck. One more crown, I'm infinite. Keep that in mind, guys. One more crown and we're infinite. I just bought a crown. Give one more crown and we're infinite. I just bought one. So for right now, I can put Lumen Vase on her, no? Nah, I don't need Biscuit. I, I go infinite on my, on my crown face. I'll show you. Once I just once I get one more crown, I go infinite. With, with. So Charmed. If I get Lumen Charm, I have infinite as well. I'll show you what it, I'll show you what happens. I'll show you what happens. Is there another shot before the game's over? Do we know? Not always, huh? Not always. Everything during crown phase is free. Anybody want frenzy wrench? So you can add frenzy to an item. Now what item would you want to put it on? Imagine frenzy berry blade. That means you have to have two recycle. It's kind of hard. So we're crowning it up. All right, guys. Charming it up, I mean. Give me a Lumen Charm right here. Oh, my goodness. I spent the whole game talking about it. And here it is. Here it fucking is. 
We're infinite. Thank you to Isaac for this one. Thank you to Isaac for this one. Wait. Oh, get out of here. Alright, boys. How do you fucking do? And now we do greed for Berry Blade. Yes. What I mean by infinite? What do I mean? Let me show you. Let me show you. Oh, three gold. Hey, it's so greedy. Drop on in. Hope the devs don't patch this one. Or maybe they should. Alright. So we play Sneasel and Junkhead. All right. We use junk on junkhead. There it is. Infinite junk. Infinite draw. Mom, get the camera. Let's draw a card. Yo, oh, you want to get in there? You want to get in there? Uh, if I play her, it doesn't stop anything, right? Never play my leader, we're good. Because that's that ends because of the crown. So never play leader, we're good. We can get you in there, why not? We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. GG. Get in there, Jumbo. We're going to be here for a while, boys. We're going to be here for a while. But you know what? I'm going to get... Wait, does this count as a combo? So if I kill every minion, every thing, does it just count for like times eight combo? Holy shit. I can't lose, I know. Cannot lose, sir. I know, it's next in the fat chest. This is the thing. Like, now that I'm streaming it, the devs are going to do something about it. So I'm sorry, not sorry, I guess. Nah, the devs don't watch my stream. But I don't make a YouTube video. So what you guys got to do is watch the YouTube video. And then see if the devs notice. Get out there, Junkhead. Lumen Ring has arrived. Oh, wait. We can draw two. Oh, oh, my goodness. That's too much. It's too much. What do you mean don't play vase? What's wrong with playing vase? We're gonna be here for a while, guys. We're gonna be here for a while. Yeah, there's one lumen effect, but this is a lumen ring. Yeah, I guess now we know. His junk is crowned. Wait. As long as I don't play my leader, I'm good, right? I can replay my junk crown? Something about that is scaring me. You know what's really important? is to get bomb, because bomb makes your junks do damage. Can you ask as much to your hammers? No, because they don't have a counter.
Oh, but don't play Lumen here. Play Lumen in my turn. The game breaks. What happens? I'm not going to touch it. Got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it. Yo, Noir Grip next to Twitch Prime, buddy. Stop adding junk. Why did I hit junk head? I already have enough junk in my deck. No allies to heal. You had to report me. Hey, I didn't create this monster. That's satisfying. Look at that. My deck's massive. I, I think I hit the um. I broke the game. I scared the fuck out of me. I thought I just broke the thing. Okay, she just never attacks. We're stuck in limbo. Yeah, I shouldn't have hit junk. I hit junk too many times because now, now I'm drawing too much junk. It's okay. We can make it work. Yeah, I don't want to soft lock. I was scared I was gonna soft lock. I was like, wait, putting on zero it seems soft locky. It's a little soft locky, huh? But it's okay. It's good. But this is so we're in one big soft lock that we can interact with. The only problem is I put too many chunks in my deck. But that's easily solvable because it looks like I don't have a max hand size. Who would have thunk there's no max hand size? That's very useful because now I can just draw nothing but... So take this out. As long as all the junks are in my hand... As long as all the junks are in my hand, we draw nothing but good cards. Alright, game's over. Sung Sung Box. All I want to do is draw into hammers. One hammer. Two hammer. We're gonna be here for a while. Now I could win the old fashioned way. But where's the fun of that? Now that I know there's no max hand size, it changes everything. But these are the kind of things that made Slay the Spire get changed, right? Because we people broke the game of Slay the Spire, and then the devs didn't think about it. It's just, it reminds me of Slay the Spire in the beginning of the, uh, the heydays, when we'd go infinite with Zap. You take one Zap in Prime, there's a, there a power on the defect called Prime. It says when you, when you evoke an orb, you draw a card. You just play zero cost Zap, you're infinite. So you should draw cards by evoking orbs. Hey, welcome to the welcome to the stream, Bron. All right, got the three win streak, boys. What do we unlock? Wait, I haven't won. Yeah, I won. This game's over. Game's over. What's the unlock? Let's find out. That's true, Croesus. That's it. That's all it takes. That's all it takes. But maybe this is actually a fun part of the game. Maybe, like, setting this up is, like, a, a reward. For those who are patient. I mean, it's not that hard to set up, though.
Wait, there's a re Is this- wait, isn't there like supposed to be like a resummon? Should I wait for the- the- No, I shouldn't wait. This guy is wave 2? No, but I'm saying, isn't there supposed to be like a whole new set of minions? But if I end turn, then... And then I have all these jugs to deal with. The fight has to start, yeah. So now I have the question, guys. Do you want to wait for the minions to summon with the advantage of, well, he's one life? Or... Yeah, the game's over. I don't need money. You're right. I don't need money. <laughs> Why do I need money? Money's a concept for people who are not infinite. Hey, that's kind of shitty. Nothing to greed for? Nothing to live for? I don't know if I like that. Yeah, why do I need money? Very good, very good point. No decisions matter at this point. Simply click buttons. Add charms. Win game. But I said I want to do the infinite at least once, so we're gonna we're gonna ride it out. We're gonna ride it out. Cause I wanted to do infinite just at least once. You're never gonna see the battlefield. Dejan, you're never seeing the battlefield. You're a hand warrior. Put it on hammer? Oh my god, put it on hammer so I don't waste save time. Alright, true, true, true. Put a hammer, save myself some time. My bad. My bad. Where's my draw to? I know. Well, we're gonna have to go jump crazy. <laughs> no, 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 no. I had made some accidental mistakes. When it comes to infinites, no mistakes can be had. I need Lumen. I need my Lumen Vaz. There she blows. Time to redraw into the junk so I don't have to play any more junks ever. All right, time to redraw into junks. You ready? Oh, this is too risky. We do this just in case. But now we redraw to drunks. Perfect. Are we doing nothing but junks in the deck? All right. So now we draw all the junks into our hands. Just hear me out, guys. We draw every single junk into our hands, and then we play all our hammers. GG. That simple. It's only gonna take a couple of hours. Yeah, and Chunk is the strongest guard of the game. Okay, let's start doing damage. So here's what we want to do. So if I did Berry Blade. Uh, I need pure pain space. Get out of here.
Can you give me the hammer? Hammer. I don't care about silence. He's dead. I don't care. Let's put the hammer. Hammer. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Hammer. 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 I'm gonna give up on you, hammer. I'm gonna give up on you. Is Isaac here? No, Isaac dipped. I'll, I'll Discord ping him. I sent him a ping on Discord so he can come Marvel. The fuck? Tell me I have to start this way. Where's Isaac? Isaac, you told me I could go infinite, could go infinite, but this freaking hog didn't. Please help. I have a lot of junk, but I have so much junk in my deck. Shouldn't I sunk song? I have so much junk in my deck. I should just play Sung Sung a whole bunch of times. Guys, I have to Sung Sung because I got way too much junk in my deck. What happens if you go below zero, guys? What happens if you go below zero? What happens if you go below zero um, on the counter? I know it's a lot less interactive, I know. I see that. Alright guys, time to find out what happens when you go below zero, okay? All the junk is becoming sung sung fuel. Time to find out. Alright guys, get ready. Can you go below zero? Yeah, you can. GG, get fucked. GG, get fucked. Alright, let's get rid of all the drunk and let's win the game. I'll leave one drunk in the deck. Nah, Tom's not gonna die. He's fine. Leave one drunk in the deck so we can, we can do this drunk thing. Actually, I don't need drunks anymore because drunk has got me. GG.
four turns? <laughs> I gotta wait four turns? What? That doesn't count as a recall? That's messed up. What's going on with this game? Sung Song Bucks. Wait, Smack Pack's a problem. What's up, Razor? How you doing, brother? You know, I have a funny thing to tell you, Razor. And it's... Recall. Into Big Smacks. You guys ready for this? Where's Sung Sung? Wait, 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 where's Sung Sung? I was gonna do Sung Sung into... Well, at this point, it doesn't matter. Oh, I still want to find Sung Song. Wait. Okay, you ready? Check this out. I don't want you to attack hogs. To Big Berry Blade. Oh, they're resummoning. We got them to resummon, no? So the car drawing cards is important. So he's doing three times that. I can put the jumbo take the hit, I guess. I then let them resummon get the gold, but I don't need gold, the game's over. Oh, that's right, it's just one hug. That's right, GG. Okay, so we could shade scope. So guys, if we added the charm to that blade, we can do. So we could shade our blade so we can kill quicker because we're infinite, right? Does muncher help? We can muncher like. I mean, we're infinite. Nothing really matters, right? Muncher make the infinite faster, but on what though? The problem with the is that I had to get enough on what? I think the deck's fine. 
I don't think I should just go put it on like a on the blade, which by the way could have been even more. Wait, this could have been a greedy. Oh, it's still a greedy blade. Biscuit. Biscuit doesn't do a damn thing. Should I get the berry crown? Should I um do pink berry juice because that helps me with go infinite HP as well? It might be a situation where you had to get infinite HP. Just to be sure, you know? Just to do haze keg. You can do infinite hazes. But I like the way I spend my money. Who? Who wants that? Sneasel. Really doesn't matter. Oh, aimless. Aimless hammers. Aimless juice. Aimless juice. Oh, shit. Pink berry? Well, instead of pink... Instead of... What if I just do it on, like, hammer? It could kill quicker, no? Aimless juice sounds hilarious. This run's cool. All right, boys. Three bells, three win streak. Let's go. Crown vase. Sure. Makes my life a lot easier. I want to bury blade, but you know, good shot, good call, good call. Vamos. Godot. Scary little boy. Nom and Stompy. Alright. Junkhead. Sneasel. Junk. Vaz. So we gotta draw out all our cards. And then we are infinite. Alright guys. We know the drill. I don't want to fuck it up. I don't want to fuck it up. GG. Wait, just, want, just to be sure, we're drawing nothing but... So there's no way I can fuck this up. Just to be sure. Did I do too much trash? Did I trash myself too much? Alright. It's time, my friends. Time to play some stuff.
Wait, 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 wait. He's counting down. Let me silence your ass, dude. What the fuck are you counting down for? What the hell? Are you trying to count down on me? That was br close call. I think this berry blade recycles though is kind of annoying. I can't believe I'm doing this to my old teammates. Oh, I want to do some pink berries. True. It takes a little bit long. It takes a while. You know what makes it really faster, guys? Bomb bomb. Bomb bomb is uh, it's a great way to do this. Yeah, I, 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 if I ever get to the brink of recycling too much, I will just make more trash. Do not worry. Just hammers faster. True. It also prevents the whole recycling business. I mean, we could do berry juice just in case. This is one of those things you do like in the comfort of your own home. You don't usually stream this kind of shit, but here we are. Streaming it. Normally you're eating food, talking to your friends. But we are your friends. Alright, let's do that. You think my next boss will crush you? Oh wait. Wait. That affects. My next boss HP? Wait a minute. Uh, so that's gonna end the win streak. Uh, there goes the win streak. Oh god. Oh. That's fine. I don't need three anyways, exactly. I almost killed my own Sneasel. Uh, holy. Boys, what's the combo on that? Have we, have we kept track of the combo? Is there an achievement for this? What's the combo? Let me see. Nine combo. GG. Okay. Uh, what's this? Frost Jailer. While active, add unmovable to all enemies. 
Frost Crusher, Frost Bomber, Frost Muncher. Uh, destroy the rightmost card in your hand. Uh, that's a little anticlimactic. How are we feeling? I, I guess ads are not important because we're going infinite. But holy crap! Um, so how do I beat this without infinite? My question. More than the first six? Yeah, I presume. I presume as well. I also presume. How does it feel if we were first person and auto in back of infinite? I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. It doesn't feel that great. Hey, it's fine. I gotta win Shriek, who gives a fuck? No, I know, it's okay. Now, just to be sure. And nothing but junk on the retro, right? Yay. Let us go. Free your pants face. Try to start hammering, right? You had barrage fizzle. Barrage fizzle. <laughs> it's okay. These hammers got the job. Now these hammers are really fucking slow. I, I should have bomb bomb. Bomb bomb would have made this so much easier. Is there a way to make this infinite faster? Space Odyssey is going for an Odyssey with this one. Can you play face of the hammers? You want me to? If I do that though, then so it says when you play vase, it says it says remove it clears the effects. Right? But then I won't have the card draw anymore. It's gonna be hard to draw back into them, though. I lose a draw, which makes it much harder to like. I feel like I feel like the card draw ends up being faster, no? Only one base can be active, exactly. But yeah, I should have definitely had like a bomb bomb. Bomb bomb would have made this a lot faster. Or like demonize on one of the things. Like imagine demonizing the hammer or something. Or anything.
Anything but just a naked hammer. The only thing I gotta do is not hit my Sneasel. Why does this get plus... T Wait, what's that? What, why is it like this? Oh, it's, it's showing me the greed. Okay. Show me the greed. Got it. Alright, it's getting awful close to my sneeze hole. I gotta kill the front line so it doesn't hit my... I don't want to misclick. How could Jake is always so tedious? Well, because that starts jank. Now there's a way to make jank a le lot less tedious. Frost Muncher. Booty Clincher. Alrighty. So, if this is the final... There's more stuff to be summoned, right? So, let's we'll see what happens when I kill Frost Jailer. Let's see what happens. Yeah, I, I, I got the 9 combo from the last fight. Oh, that's it! Oh! Throw the vase? <laughs> Through the vase. Was I not supposed to throw the vase? Okay, what happens? That was the true ending. Ah, GG. Big beautiful vase up the staircase. Alright guys, we found the true ending. The way we got there, you know, okay. Let's focus on the ending. <laughs> TG guys, GG's. Yeah, it's Chucklefish. Chucklefish has the cute little artsy sort of stuff going on. There's also a Chuckle Charm. Well, there was... We were playing a good old-fashioned Space Odyssey... Um, Run. What's her name? What's her name outside of Space Odyssey? I forgot her real name. We had a good thing going. I'm curious how hard that boss is. Um, general. Vanquished. New map event unlocked. Defeat the Heart of the Storm. Done. New charm unlocked. Chief of three winning streak. Done. New charm unlocked. We got a couple charms. Got one map event, two couple charms. All right, let's go to Icebreaker Cabin. We got the Gnome Traveler, a sneaky gnome who will give you some items for free, no strings attached. Seems too good to be true, huh? That sounds interesting. What's the charm you get? Let's find out. The charm you get for three win streak is... Critical Charm. 
Doubles effects if this is the right most card in your hands. That is sick. That is sick. Critical charm. Okay, this is spark charm. Triggered immediately when deployed cannot be recalled. Trigger immediately when deployed cannot be recalled. There are some really powerful things that have a big turn counter. We can use some stuff with the spark. Cannot be recalled is also like a pretty big negative effect. But you can play around that, right? You can you can chump block, you can protect things. That sounds like spark is gonna be really, really useful for sure. You had a, a, a wart with the spark and crown, crowns lumen, and crowns frenzy T. Start fight with four attacks, each putting four poison and two deny. Wow. And then the, the not recall aspect you can kind of play around, no problem. It's like instead of treating your hero like a hero, which you should, you make sure he can't die, you also have the the not recalled champion, you treat it protected as well. In fact, it feels like it's a very easy to do survivability stuff in terms of all the chump blocking. The game is pretty balanced, guys. I don't know about you, but I feel like I can use my resources to protect things in a very reasonable way. These little chump blockers are very effective. Now, I don't know how balanced the end boss is because I haven't got there naturally, but we'll see. All right, guys, that was a seven hour stream back to back. Three win streak. A lot of content for the day. I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching, boys. Drop a follow if you're new here. We're going to do some Spire and some Wild Frost. And yeah, I'm out of here, guys. GG's. Good night.